Perhaps you shouldn't drink so much on an empty stomach. Perhaps you should wear lipstick if you're gonna act like my mother. Say the word and I'll escort you home. And leave your guests? In a heartbeat. I care for you too much to subject you to an evening of forced smiles, Elena. You, you are the one not acting like yourself. Since when do politics bore you? Since huh? when did you start caring what I think? You... If you wish, I'll have him escorted out. I can handle him. For the love of God, let's get out of this place. I can handle her! You must tell me how you met. Years ago, in Spain. We were at finishing school together. Oh, how nice. You were reunited so he could finish. Don't force me to embarrass you. Sorry. Too late. <laughs> so... Tell me, Count, what does your title rank among noblemen? Is higher than, say, a duke? Oh, it's rather common, actually. Much like a dome. Oh, he's a delight. Rich, good-looking, and royalty. Is there anything I can say that would make you leave? Yeah, you can fall to your knees and beg me to take you back. I would not want to ruin my dress. Well, it's just as well. I am enjoying single life. Is that supposed to make me jealous? Does it? Never. Good. So tell me, who's been looking after Joaquin while her mother spends her nights out? I have not been spending my nights out. I haven't even told Joaquin. Now I think you should go. You know, let me go. I finally understand why you left me, Elena. It was beneath you to marry a person like me in the first place. Now I know oh, you are your drunk. Your stepfather will be so proud to see you take your rightful place on the arms of royalty. Keep your voice down. Well, congratulations, your highness. <laughs> If you didn't know me better than that, then you never knew me at all. No. Thank you for your hospitality, Count. 